what's up everyone I just wanted to go ahead and make a quick video update telling everyone that the internet is back our internet connection is back I I emailed one of the um, I guess the executives the people ahead of the internet company the NCTC company that we uh, that provides our internet and I emailed them and then after a lot of searching I mean it was there was a lot of searching I did a lot of research looking into the trying to find the email of someone regarding that company finally found it so I emailed them and the company north a state north of here is actually the one that's ahead of it and they emailed me back and told me that well they said well just unplug all the cables from the router and disconnect the power cable for 30 seconds to a minute, and that's what I did. It didn't work. He said, man, I'm sorry to hear that the simple system reboot wasn't good enough. Um, and then I even talked to people locally on the local forum, next door forum. And a few of them have been having that issue. So, there was that. But finally, at about 11.30 this morning... When he emailed back, or actually I finally got the email, we have one bar here, I do, with 4G LTE in the house. I have to go outside to get two or three. If I put the phone up in the medium between the living room and kitchen, then I get two bars. But my parents get none. And he finally he emailed and said, it might be best if you just email instead of call, since you and your family only get no signal to maybe one bar at the most. He said it probably be best to email so you don't get a dropped call. So I did. And suddenly after talking to him, he said, well, I'm going to, uh, we'll send out a signal and see where the issue is located. And he said that, that he would need my address and all that. And the account number, the address, the name, the phone number and all that, which we don't have a home phone with him anymore. And suddenly came back before I was even, before I was even able to email him. I was not even able to tell him anything. And I told him, well, it came back. <laughs> then I had to go back into the system administration information, the admin, and sign in on the uh, Wi-Fi extender, reconnect it to the router, and get everything back and running. Then all of our devices were back. So, that's good news. So now, my parents can also get cell phone signal using the micro cell tower. And I get full signal now because of the micro cell tower plugged to the router. But, what's weird, what's really crazy is, um, your body actually has a withdrawal when, he, when there's no internet connection. And I, uh, I decided, well, I'll leave the devices away from me when I go to sleep. And my body had a weird withdrawal. Like a emptiness, a disconnection. Constantly wanting to go back to the internet. Or stream something. It's like your body constantly wants to stream something or go back. It's weird. So eventually, I, because a lot of times I want to use ASMR to relax, and with no internet, I had no ASMR. So, yeah. But then you realize, look, the lights are on the setting they're on, and there's no changing the color, there's no changing the brightness, because there's no internet connection. You can still flip the switch and turn them on and off, but, or press the button on the, sm on the smart socket and turn the switch, turn the, the lights on and off that way, but... <laughs> but then you realize how disconnected you feel, how used to the internet you are, and without it, you actually get a strange anxiety, which we don't need that. That's not good. That's exactly what they want. They want people to be so dependent and so on this stuff and so connected to modern technology that we can't escape from it, and uh, we don't want that. And you realize when that happens that 
that that's that's how dependent we are and how addicted I guess you'd say we are to technology well there's no TV there's no fire stick there's no speaker there's no smart speakers there's no prayer player there's no TV there, well there's antenna TV I did do that there's no phone there's no tablet so you're like well then you realize how dependent we are on that so I had to put the phone up on in the medium between the uh, living room and the kitchen and use that as data streaming to watch something to relax to before I fell asleep and then on the tablet I used it as a mobile hotspot and then turned the stuff off and went to sleep emailed the very next day and they situated they got it situated and then I had to type in the IP address of the, the Wi-Fi extender and sign back in type in the administration information admin and then uh, let it uh, copy the router basically mirror it and uh, then I was able to get the, the router the internet and the um, the Wi-Fi extender going again and I guess they fixed it so even though there was only a couple of other people dealing with that in our area they fixed it after I messaged the corporation so anyway yeah so it's back bottom line it's back but the weird thing is how odd you feel and how anxious how there's like this I started feeling a weird withdrawal it's hard to explain this would literal withdrawal but that's not good we need to disconnect ourselves unplug so to speak because that's healthy anyway it's back bottom line it's back signing out